new 21 Savage Metro Boomin mixtape. It's not good. It's out there like Ka and Rock Marciano, who are similarly laid back and minimal. Obviously, they come to completely different artistic and lyrical conclusions than 21 does, but I mean, it's not like the foundational ideas of what make him special as an artist are that hard to come by. I'm feeling a strong three to a light four on this thing. Um, be too bloated for somebody who's just now evolving out of being a one-trick pony. Yes, it's it's definitely got more variety, more flavor, more energy than any solo 21 record so far. But I still think it's going to be a bit longer before we hear 21 Savage dominate almost an hour of material and it's engaging in flames from start to finish. I'm glad to hear he's growing though, and I guess I do agree with the sentiment of the title over here. This is his best personal, solo, commercial work to date. So there you go. I'm feeling a light to decent seven on this thing. Favorites of the year. Though surely I will give it credit for having some pretty good and pretty infectious hooks here and there, as well as some freakishly cutthroat one-liners. I thought this project was pretty solid. More bangers than snoozers on this thing. I'm feeling a light seven on this thing. Trample and the versatility of the original Savage Mode a lot. More detail, personality, dimensions, and variations, things I was just dying for on that first project. And while, yeah, there are some tracks I think I'm a little indifferent toward or are just sheer duds, there's nothing really here that wouldn't make me excited to listen to a Savage Mode 3. Feeling a light to decent 7 on this one, 